Uh, the injuries from the game and from the weekend of the team, so our BioFlow recovery report. And there's the, my BioFlow there, just tucked under my, my uh, shirt. Uh, magnificent. Used by many, for, not a very good shot, used by many for natural pain relief, <laughs> recovery and wellness. More on BioFlow in a moment. But the injury fallout, Stephen Hill hobbling from the ground, boys. Well, it rains, it pours, Scotty, and Fremantle have been under pressure. Stephen Hill's been a standout the last month to have him going through sorters. Now, will he play sore? Will he be out next week? I mean, it's a disaster in a sense, but these are the way the ball rolls with clubs that are struggling. But Nat Fife, Nat Fife out for the season. Makes sense, doesn't it? It's a heartbreaker. It's a heartbreak. We all love watching Nat Fife. Come on. We do. And he's out for the season. Yep. How come he's out for the season? Well, he's got a broken leg. Yeah, but will it get fixed? And why, it, why did it break? Why didn't that Fife break his leg? You're not happy being going back I'm on not, the ground. I'm not, I said on the show <laughs> at the, in that final last year, he shouldn't have went back on the ground, and I said he shouldn't have played. Now, I don't know what plate was put in his leg, but you should not have a broken fibula again the next on. season. You're, you're questioning the medical I'm, stuff. I'm just saying it's, uh, it's got to be looked into so we all learn from it, because this game can't have the best players not rolling out and playing each week. I agree with you. Like, we well, don't necessarily agree about coming back on the ground, but it, we agree we want him back playing. And but what's happened? Like I said, suspect that he could play again this year. They've just decided they that parked him. They, they parked him. him. He's yeah. probably, you know, the medical staff have probably said you're going to be right by round 18, and they just said we're going to put you away at the moment. We'll bring you back next year. What? Look, as a, as a lover of footy and all the free medal supporters, why did this happen? An explanation. Take us through. Come on this show and explain exactly how Nat Fife is missing the season because we don't really know. Oh, he's out for the season. It just, it's, it's not acceptable. We need to have a clearer picture of what's happened, Hutchie. You made your point. Uh, plenty of those guys have spent some awful time this year already. Already, Deboa Razunga was back yesterday. Everton, Serban, Pierce. Barlow had 39 the waffle more on that later. Dawson left out too. So they are absolutely turning this list over on the run. And all those guys will be nervous about their futures at the end of the season, which brings us... I'll tell you about Nick Rewalt. He does wear, uh, he does wear the... The bioflow. He does. Yeah, he the uses the bioflow. You'll always see Nick Re I've got one here. Yeah. How am I looking? Magnificent. See, uh, that's what happened. Your I was ugly before I started your wearing performance it. No, but, actually but Nick, Nick has always worn one of these. You know yeah, that. There you go. Uh, yeah, We've all got them. Very quickly. <laughs> right, before we head to the break, uh, you mentioned BioFlow. Matt Prittis is aware of BioFlow. And recently we sent he and Mark Lacroix in a Hammersley golf course for a club shootout, a golf shootout with a twist to see whether Matt's secret BioFlow weapon could prove the difference. And this all comes to you for BioFlow, the leading magnotherapy company for over 20 years. G'day guys, Matt Prittis here from the West Coast Eagles. Today I'm lucky enough to have Mark Lacroix with me. He's probably one of our most all-round sportsmen. Today he's going to give me some of his tips with uh, golf, which I need a lot of help. Oh. <laughs> Alrighty Mark, uh, you've got my competitive juices flowing. <laughs> um, you give me the tips. Now we're going to have a little competition. We'll go longest drive and closest to the pin. So what have we got on it? Coffees? Coffees. Lunch Sounds tomorrow? Good. Lunch. Let's All do right. lunch. Alright. Well, that's gone well wide. Alrighty mate, I'll wear one of these. It's a BioFlow uh, wristband. I reckon it helps me with my recovery. It's obviously helped me today in the longest drive. <laughs> So, mate, would you like to try one? Yeah, I didn't know you had a secret weapon, mate. Putting green, how do you like your chances? Well, you know what they say, mate, drive for show, putt for dough, and uh, <laughs> any chance I get to take your money, I'll be happy. Yeah, I've used magnets since the age of 17, 18. Um, introduced um, down at Subiaco Footy Club, um, helped me with shin splints, and from that point, it's probably something I've been pretty open-minded with. All it does is help enhance um, blood flow, and it's something that I've I've really enjoyed and I think it's, it's really helped. I'm pretty happy right now. <laughs> the most competitive bloke at our footy club. Hates losing. It's, uh, thanks for coming down mate, it's a great day. And uh, it's good to be here. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs>